Hey everyone, how are you guys? Welcome to today's video. I'm really excited because we are setting up my travel journal for my trip coming up to Turks and Caicos. So I actually have never set up a travel journal and it's the first time I'm going to be doing it and I have no idea what I'm doing. I have little setup ideas but truly we're just gonna go with it today as you can see we are using the hubman and chub girl travel stationery box i'm so excited if you missed that video of me unboxing everything i'm gonna leave it here linked in the cards and down below it's on my channel it's such a fun video so go check it out if you haven't i'm not going to show everything that was in that box today but i'm showing you a lot of like the big pieces obviously as you can see here so sorry there's a little glare on that i'm just going to move that for a second so yeah, I definitely wanted to pull a lot of these things in because obviously it's travel themed. So let's get So I'm going to show you guys what we have in front of us here. So these are the two journals that came in the stationery box. And I think I have decided to go with this one. It just, I love the airplane. I love the kind of world map on the background. And I think it just really represents traveling. This one is going to be my backup whenever I finish and fill this baby up. I will move on to this one, but it's adorable as well. So we're gonna use that today. We also have my usuals here. We have my tweezers from Printpression, a Tombow Fudenosuke brush pen um, in the soft tip, and then this is a Uni, um, I think this is in a 0.5 uh, gel pen. We have our Tombow markers here, and these are the color swatches here. A purple, which is 620, a green, 192, and a blue, 451. We, of course, have sticker sheets. We have these are from Hubman and Chub Girl. We also have the two-page kit as well. I'm not sure what I'm using yet. Honestly, I have nothing planned really and then i have these four smaller sheets and then this is just the um little travel planner bag that it was also in the box so i'm just gonna put this aside i'm definitely bringing this on vacation with me then i also have the two washi tapes that uh, were in the box as well all right so like i said i don't have too much set up i have some things um planned in here which i'm going to show you um but yeah anyway so the setup that i'm thinking is to have uh you know kind of like a where we're going the dates we're going and like the itinerary here and then this i wanted to do a packing list on this page um a to-do list on this page possibly dutch doors which I will get to in a second um, and then I want to set up a page for each day so we're gonna be gone August 2nd to the 7th so we're gonna have a solid five days I think I'll set up possibly six but um, I want to set up a page for each day so I can kind of you know journal and junk journal anything that happened that particular day and yeah so let's jump into it I think right off the bat let's write in my name is that close enough yeah that's good so again i do have the Furunosuke brush pen it's the soft tip so i think i'm just going to journal i'm really not good at um hand lettering so please don't come for me but i'm just going to do my best just want to write that in i feel like i can't breathe All right, there's my name, Jerlyn. If you guys are new, welcome. I hope you guys enjoy, stick around, and subscribe. If you do, I would love it if you would hit the notification bell to, uh, to be notified whenever we post things. But, all right, I feel like when I zoom in too much, it gets darker. I don't know. So there's that, and I feel like we could maybe go in with some stickers here. Okay, I think I wanna do a suitcase because it's adorable, and these stickers are amazing quality. They're on this really beautiful like vinyl paper. Should we just keep it simple? I could add washi tape here, but you know what? We can always come back to it. I do wanna get into actually setting up the pages. Again, this is kind of like a cover page. I'm gonna leave blank in case I wanted to make like an intro page for my travel journal. But right now I'm really focused and I wanna hone in on this so, section. I wanted to do a destination, travel dates, um, I love these stickers in particular because there are there's headers here so I can use like an itinerary header accommodations 
I'm definitely going to use those two here. Let's go in with some colors first. I think I kind of like the purple. I'm really feeling this purple. You guys truly don't know how nervous I am doing this. It's like nerve wracking to me because I'm just going with the flow and I want it to be perfect, but I need to remind myself things just aren't gonna always be perfect and I have to keep telling myself that. So I'm gonna put in here Turks and Caicos. And then I'm gonna go in and add a little swatch right down here to put in the dates that we're going okay i guess i'll just write that with pen i think so we're gonna go august 2nd to august 7th okay cute i don't hate it <laughs> i was just so scared i was gonna hate it all right and then we could use this accommodations hmm let's see i'm scared i don't know why i always get nervous when it comes to like doing this type of stuff and journaling oh my gosh the sticker is so sticky okay oh i just don't know if i like it but you know what we are here already and we're just going to put it down so accommodations and put in like a big swatch so i can write in where we're staying right there but then i do want to put in our itinerary so i am going to use this sticker here and we're going to try to just center that here okay and then i'm going to try to lay out a few boxes so i'm trying to figure out maybe three on top two on the bottom all right you guys i hope you are able to see these boxes somehow they are a little bit light because and a little bit of like a different color because somehow there was I don't know if there was like purple ink on here, but the purple started mixing with the blue. So some of these lines are a little bit darker and like a purple ombre. It's a whole thing. I'm so bad at this, which is why I was so scared to make this video. But I'm going to put in the days now because we're here. We're here and we're just, we're gonna make it work. But let me just find some Monday to Sunday stickers. And then we can actually put in the days. So I'm thinking, should we just do like Monday the 2nd? All right, we're just going to go with those because I don't know. I like them. So we're going to start on Friday the 2nd, and then we're going to work our way through. And then I could actually color these in. Ooh, yeah, because these are on matte white paper, and I have all of these here. So we're going to start off on Friday because Friday is August 2nd right here. Leave room for the actual um, numbered day, which actually, should we just do that now? Let's just do it now while we're here. Friday the 2nd. I'll just use these little, or actually I have other ones. This blue or that purple. All right, we're going to go with the blue, I think, because... I think I like the blue. So we'll put Friday the 2nd. We have a Saturday. Put that right here. The 3rd. My boxes are horrific. <laughs> they look terrible. Sunday the 4th. Okay. Then we have Monday down here, and that's the 5th, Tuesday, I'll just put both of these down on Wednesday. So I really didn't have to highlight that last one there, the Thursday, but that's okay. We're already here. It's already done. And... 
I'm so excited. All right. Oh my gosh, how cute you guys. Oh, I love that. All right, I wanna put some more of these like stickers in. I'm gonna use these smaller ones because we're working with limited space here. So let's do the globe because we haven't used the globe yet. I'll put that in this corner. We can use a map, maybe. Oh, we have arrival departure, that over here. I really like this luggage tag here. I think it's so cute. So we can put this maybe this way. All right, let's stick with that for now. How adorable. I love it, love it, love it. I do wanna get into the next page because I wanna do Dutch doors on this page, um, which means you basically cut this part here and you'll be able to see to this other side so i've already determined i want a packing list here and a to-do list back here so i do want to use this header where is it packing list so i want to at least make sure the dutch door is this wide right here so let's just measure it and make sure let's just make a really light rough line just so we know where we can lay our washi so i saw this on several like journaling videos and i was obsessed so i think i want to use this and we're just going to put it right at the edge here line it up with that line we made with the pencil so we kind of know where to cut we're just going to cut right along this line i just want to make sure this is as straight as possible okay then we can wrap it on this side oh I'm so excited for these Dutch doors again I've never done this it's the first time I'm doing this so don't come for me if there's a better way to do this because I know there is there probably is for sure but um yeah we're just gonna do it my way because <laughs> this is the only way I know all right maybe should I bend it first I'm like just so you guys have an idea of like what I'm trying to do. Like that. <gasps> so the again, packing list is here, to-do list back here, but we're actually just gonna cut this because we are here and we're gonna freehand, y'all. I'm just gonna go in. Let's put washi on this side as well. I'm gonna put the same washi actually. And let's do that on this side. Try to line this baby up close to the edge. Oop, okay. Thinking about rounding these edges just to give it a little bit more um, character. Again, I'm just freehanding you guys. It's adorable. What do you guys think? I love it. I love it, love it. I think it's so cute. Okay. And let's see, packing list. So we can just use our sticker right here, I think. <gasps> Did the washi tape take up too much space? I hope not, let's just see. Packing list, no, it's gonna be perfect. Oh, I'm so excited. Should we use some more washi? I just like, I don't know why I'm in the mood to layer. Let's just do it because we're here already and we might as well. I'm just gonna rip this side. And then lay this down. We'll try to lay this down as straight as possible in the middle. Okay. Oh my gosh, how adorable. All right, and then this is our to-do list. So we can, I guess I can just hand letter some of these things and then add in the stickers around it. Or, oh, we have these boxes here. I can just use one of these but i have my to-do scripts let me find them we have these scripts here from the prairie planner and i think we could definitely do the green i like the green a lot there we go we'll put our to-do in here oh oh no no oh gosh to be careful to-dos so now we can write in our to-do list 
Oh my gosh, y'all, I love this so far. So I definitely think I want to put in some dots to check off so I can check off the packing list and lines. So I'm just going to kind of go in with every other color and I'm gonna speed this part up. I love it. It's so cute. Look at this. So I did every other line and I alternated colors. I did leave a space down here where I could add more dots, but I also wanted to leave it blank just in case I wanted to write a big reminder or anything like that, or just like a little space for decoration maybe. So I love this. Let's add some more stickers. Let's do the mini stickers. I definitely have to do the, where's the luggage? Just another mini sheet. Oh, here we go. Because this is the packing section. So I definitely like this little, this one right here. Let's put it here on the side. And then we can do this little double suitcase here. And we'll put that maybe right here. So I'm actually going to pretty much do the same thing I did here on the colors like this uh, on the side. So I'll be right back. Guys, we have our to-do list done. I love these pages so far. It looks better than I could have imagined because again, this is my first time doing this and I don't really know what I'm doing. I'm trying to just going with the flow. So I'm actually going to use this other washi tape just to just start laying down on some of these pages here and I'm just going to rip them. I'm gonna do a little bit on the top, a little bit on the bottom. These are going to be the daily pages as I had mentioned. So I wanna put a little bit of decoration um, on them but I do wanna leave room for myself to journal if I wanted to add any like receipts or pictures because I do have a um, like little printer for photos. So I figured we could go back to using these again. These are Monday to Sunday stickers, but these are just the abbreviated ones where I use these full ones here. So we're gonna um, use these. Start off with Friday because we are leaving on a Friday. I'm actually just gonna use these boxes from this kit right here. This is the Let's Travel Mini Planner Kit. It's a two page kit, but there's really awesome useful boxes. So I'm just going to use these to um, add as little headers and like date covers. So I'm so excited to have this set up. Do you guys do this before you travel? Like you set up your planner. So once you get there, you don't really have to think about it too much. Now that everything is gonna be set up, I can honestly just go in with, um, again, my journaling, um, any other stickers or pictures to add. I think I'm gonna put this up here. Should we add in some lines for some color? Let's maybe do that, kind of like how we did here, but we can do it on all the daily pages. And then I can have, I can obviously write and journal in it, but also I can add a pictures over top, which is nice and easy. So I decided not to highlight and line the whole thing. I did wanna leave some space to have some freedom, but I think this will really help prompt me write a little bit of journaling on each day with some pictures, but I'm not going to feel like a failure um, if I don't fill up the whole page with words. You know what I mean? Because this is vacation, I want it to be fun, but I really like how this turned out. I'm so excited about this. Let me know what you guys think. And yeah, I, I just, I can't wait to just fill this up and I'm definitely going to come back and show you guys how it turned out. So I'm really excited. We have tons of stickers left if you guys are curious. So these are the big pages that we have left. We, ha we can obviously do several more spreads. Look at all these little pages. I didn't even use that one up at all but tons of stickers and here is that two page kit as well. So this is more than enough stickers for several spreads. I love it. So we're just, again, quick flip through. Main page here with the itinerary, packing list, to-do list uh, before I leave and then our 
dailies for every day we are away. I absolutely love it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you have any questions, let me know down below. Check out Hubman and Chubb Girl. They give us a coupon code for 15% off. So if you want these stickers or any other stickers, they have amazing collections, you guys. So if you're interested in any of these or any of their other stickers, awesome quality, highly recommend. Um, and just use the code. I'm going to leave it here on the screen and down below. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any questions, let me know. Subscribe to the channel. Follow me on Instagram for more planner spreads. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed. I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.